Earlier this afternoon, Helene made quite a scene. Strong winds and angry waves crashing upon the Matlache Pass Bridge. And on the other side of it, water covered the streets. The feeling here, all too familiar. You know, I've got people putting their furniture on, on cinder blocks. Yeah. Legitimately, you know, and so it's, it's wild that that's where we're at. John Lynch lives in Matlache and owns the Blue Dog Restaurant. When we checked with him this afternoon, his home was okay, but the Blue Dog had taken on water again. You know, we've had the restaurant for 10 years. We didn't have floods earlier. You know, last five years, pretty consistently. Lynch says some friends' homes also flooded, and as the sun went down, the water only went up. Pine Island Road flooding out, prompting deputies to push people back and shut it down. Randy was among those turned away as he tried to check on his shop in St. James City. As much as I want to get out there for my business, uh, this is these people's homes. You know, they just want to get out and save their homes and their memories because I mean, obviously most of them probably have a lot of water in their home and it's, it's, it's too fresh. You know, we're on the second anniversary, Ian, and I, I, man, my heart goes out to everybody.